The T249 Vigilante was a prototype 37mm self-propelled anti-aircraft gun designed as a replacement for the Bofors 40mm gun and M42 Duster in U.S. Army service. The system consisted of a 37mm T256 barrel Gatling gun mounted on a lengthened M113 armored personal carrier platform. In the early 1960s, the Army decided that gun-based systems were outdated, and cancelled further development in favor of the MIM-46 Mauler missile system that also failed to enter service. The designer, the Sperry Utah Engineering Laboratory, later revived the Vigilante, rechambering it for NATO standard 35 x 228 M rounds and mounting it on a M-48 tank chassis for the DIVAD's contest. However, it ultimately lost to Ford's M247 Sergeant York that also failed to enter service. Development Very little information exists of the T249 Vigilante and its T250 cannon. The conceptual design for the T250 cannon was initiated in 1956. While the design of cannon of this caliber would ordinarily be handled by Waterley at Arsenal, it was decided that Springfield Armory would take responsibility due to their previous development experience with smaller caliber rotary cannons such the 20mm T-171. The T-250 was the largest Gatling gun ever assembled. Its 37x 219mm round was based upon a shortened M neck down 40x 311mm Bofors cartridge case. Hydraulically powered, the gun was able to vary between 120 RPMs for ground targets and 3000 RPMs for air targets. It had a 192 round drum magazine, which in the 3000 RPMs mode would have equated to approximately 5 seconds of fire. When Springfield engineers finished their work in 1962, the design was handed over to Wartfliet for production. The Sperry Utah Engineering Laboratory was selected to handle the integration of the T-250 gun with a modified M113 chassis to create the T-249. Surviving examples, one T-249 Vigilante is currently displayed at the U.S. Army Artillery Museum, at Fort Sill, OK. This example was previously located at the U.S. Army Ordnance Museum in Aberdeen, Maryland. See also, GAU-8 Avenger. GAU-13 Cannon, GAU-12 Equalizer, M61 Vulcan, non-NATO, Gyatz Shipinov GSH-6-23. References External links, Information on the Vigilante and Red Queen Projects, Springfield Armory Museum Collection Record for T-250.